Now, the inter-Korean basketball friendlies in over a decade wrapped up with a draw and with both sides taking a few wins. But according to our Oh Jung-hee, this was more than just about the competition, rather a chance to learn more about each other and explore ways to improve sports exchanges and cooperation. Wrapping up the second and final day of unification basketball games, the South and North Korean officials shared their impressions of the friendlies. A farewell dinner was held in Pyongyang on Thursday evening, hosted by Choi Hui, the chairman of North Korea's National Sports Guidance Committee. Choi said seeing the players running together, he felt the two Koreas are, in the end, one, sharing the same history and language. In sports, there's a winner and a loser, but there's no such thing when it comes to achieving unification. Let's further strengthen our sports exchanges and win even more gold medals at the 18th Asian Games. South Korea's unification minister Cho myung said every match had been heartwarming. I believe we'll move much closer to reconciliation, peace and unification if the South and the North go together, just like our basketball players did. I'm sure the success of these basketball games paved the way for more inter-Korean sports exchanges. The two Koreas played four games in total, two each on Wednesday and Thursday. On Wednesday, the teams were a mix of South and North Koreans. And on Thursday, the games were the South versus the North. This round of inter-Korean basketball games was the fourth in history, the last one having been held 15 years ago. The group of South Koreans who went to the North Korean capital for the event are returning to Seoul Friday afternoon. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.